Well, this is an article on James McKeon, who's one of the most influential men in Western Christianity. Who actually stayed in a town, um, a village near Airdrie called Glen Boyg, as you can see here. Uh, men like Smith Wigglesworth actually uh, came round to his house um, for his prayer meetings um, before he came in minister. And he started to found around, I think, 3,000 churches um, in the nations of, of Ghana and surrounding nations. And uh, um, that he was one of the founders of the Presbyterian movement, even though it seems to be given to uh, um, an American movement, uh, the, the, the Pentecostal, uh, Pentecostalism, sorry. Um, not the Presbyterian movement. He was originally from the Presbyterians, but um, he's one of the original founders of the Pentecostal movement, and he's one of the most prolific um, church um, planters in Pentecostal history. And he's from a small village which we will um, go and visit. Um, I am in collaboration with the Pentecostal church just now. Uh, to make a video about this man's life so you will hear much more uh, about this uh, in future videos Yahweh willing of course and um, we can do some videos on the Pentecostal movement um, the pros and cons and so on and uh, as Pastor Amos um, is also doing a study on the Pentecostal movement who is actually a I believe he's a Presbyterian minister Presbyterianism is carried out there. The actual symbol for Presbyterianism is the Scottish flag, which is partly the St. George's Cross as well. But we know that many German missionaries went out um, for the Presbyterian cause to West Africa. And uh, when you go out there, um, they associate Presbyterianism with um, a lot of Germans, German missionaries, and they associate Pentecostalism with many Scottish missionaries. And uh, Obviously there are a lot more denominations and uh, there are actually a lot more denominations in Ghana which actually started in Ghana such as the ICGC which is uh, the central, I think it's central gospel it's called. That's another very very good teaching and um, Holy Spirit movement in the body of Christ today. So more to come on this one about James McKeon.